Good morning, guys. Okay, today we're gonna talk about the HDS. Okay. And the valve. And the CO2. HDS, this is the stock valve. Okay. The HDS, unfortunately, because the design has been going on for over a year right now. The new mo the new ones, uh, uh, the, the, some of them, the new model, but they still have the same, the same issue. Okay. But anyway, sometime you get in this. Okay. Now, if you look at this, there is a CO2 in there. There is no room left to pierce the CO2. See that? It's already at the bottom of, there is a, a millimeter. That is not gonna be enough to pierce the CO2. And if a pierce and make like a pinhole, then it's take longer to fill the chamber, to pressurize the chamber back up again. So, what I have to do, not only just modify the old gun to shoot harder and everything, but I have, to, but we modify, I modify the valve and the cap. And I show you what happens when the modification is over, okay? And then you're gonna see how much room you have. Right now you have nothing. So if you bang in this, it's not gonna pierce. It's not gonna pierce. You wanna see? Look, nothing's coming out. <laughs> you see that? Nothing. Uh, and I show you what happened to the CO2 that is a dent. It's not pierced. You understand? So you gotta watch for that. Right there. It's not pierced. This is full. Okay. Now we're gonna modify the this. And that's why there is a lot of work involved in between upgrading the gun and the HDS need this, the modification of the cap and the valve itself. Okay. So I show you, I show you after the fact. Okay. Talk to you soon. Okay. So now is modified. Okay. All the modification is done. That's the, the valve, remodified, and the cap. So, new CO2 in there. Not dent. Now, I show you. Now, if you notice, right here, or right here, see how much more See that? That will pierce the CO2. It's gonna make a nice, open the CO2 fully, okay? And also, we recommend to slam it, okay? That's the CO2 that it's got a little bit of room in there. So, but now you have enough, now you have enough to, to pierce it, make a nice hole and open up the CO2. If you don't open the CO2, the chamber is gonna take time, so you get maybe one, one, two shots, and then you gotta wait until the CO, the, the pressure go back up, okay? And that could uh, actually spilling out the CO2 slowly is gonna freeze up the CO2, it's gonna cool down, loss FES and stuff like this. You have to open it. So, and uh, I recommend to with the gun, you just go pop two, pam, pam, make a nice one, okay, and that's it, and then you're good to go, now I'm gonna put it together, and i show you how to, how I do it, okay, okay, the gun is done, now put the CO2, put the modify cap in there, now, that's it, okay, you don't need, 
you don't need the key but if you need it that's it don't don't force it okay just attach now that the gun oh, hold on there you go now the gun is ready okay now it still need a strong top stronger than all the other tr 50 uh the uh, t40 okay all the other t40 were fine the hds need a little bit need a bit the load so what you can do you can put a uh or a rubber or ring in here so you can leave the the other key access you put a like a, an old ring in there rubber because what i'm gonna do is this twice okay now the gun is put that the co2 is fully open okay and i can shoot fast okay it doesn't take longer for the repressurize okay always finish and that's it that is out now let's check it out it's a nice hole okay fully open um now it works, but you have to do it hard. If you don't want to do it with your hand, you know, because <laughs> you got to do it hard. Uh, I recommend to do this. Now over here, I have a, a rubber mat, but you can put a, a rubber or ring in there, do the same thing. Yeah, that's it, okay? That's what you have to do with the HDS or even the other gun you can just stop it like this okay even with the other quick pierce guns okay um and that's it now up uh, one thing fps is on the description <laughs> is stated up to 500 feet per second 450 500 feet per second with three grams which is the weight of the T40 riot balls that we give you. Those are three grams. Three grams, not six grams, okay? <laughs> if you're shooting, shooting the gun with both barrels, you're not. You're gonna get half of the power, obviously. You understand? <laughs> so three grams, not six. That's what we, is tested. The FPS on the video are for one, three grams or you can shoot you can use uh 1.4 1.3 uh grams ammo and then you're gonna get the same 450 when you're shooting double okay as long as you get to 2.8 to 3 grams weight total you should be on there and also you gotta warm up the gun 80 degrees plus okay internally or the and the co2 so we're gonna keep the CO2 in a warm place, okay? So when when you put it in, it's already warm because after you pierce, it's gonna freeze, gonna cool down immediately. So, um, yeah, okay? So our gun will pierce the CO2. Other HDSs, 80% chance that they will not. And if they do, they make a small, tiny pinhole. It release the gas like very slowly. And you don't want that. You want, boom, it's done, up. Okay, that's it. Okay, bye, ciao.